Right, the usual cow chorus going on this evening. Um, I've got some grinding to be done. Um, basically, at lunchtime, I uh, I cut the uh, cut the end of this to uh, to fit, ready to be welded. Um, it needs to be such that this is absolutely square, or as close to it as possible. I know there's going to be um, it's going to be distortion in welding, but uh, let's get the gods in our side, shall we? Um, now, while I'm talking about this, there's a few things that, um, that spring to mind. One of which is a video that I saw over the weekend. Um, a guy who's saying, okay, you know, we definitely, um, yeah, that side needs grinding down. Um, a guy who was, uh, who was doing a video on uh, cutting discs. I'm reminded of this because um, I cut this out at lunchtime. Um, so slitting discs and he was singing the praises of uh, uh, an unmentioned sponsor the people who were sponsoring him obviously the people who are making diamond cutting discs now, diamond cutting discs for metal they're shite i've used them um they're slow they make an awful lot of noise um they heat your piece up enormously um, basically they take about twice as long to cut so you've got twice as long of friction against the piece and your piece gets very very hot um, part of his let me see those air quotes here test um, was uh, was using uh, was using a, th a thermometer on on you know the edge of the disc and the, and the piece um, I have never burnt myself on a disc on a cutting disc I'll Quite happily, you know, when I, when I cut this, um, I cut all the way around it. Um, it's a curved cut. Did it with a 1.2 mil slitting disc. Um, once I'd finished, I took the disc off with my hand, while this was still too too hot to go anywhere near. Um, you don't get burnt from slitting discs. You do get burnt from diamond discs. They get very very hot, and your piece gets even hotter. Um, there is. An argument to be made that slitting discs make an awful lot of dust. Um, so do diamond discs. You're you're losing the diamond grinding paste as much as the you know, or grinding paste, the grinding material, as much as you are with a with a slitting disc. They don't last very long. You know, they're sold as being you know lasting forever, but they they really don't last very long. They cut very badly after a few cuts. Um, they're just shit basically, an awful lot of money. Um, Beware of people selling snake oil on YouTube. Um, it's uh, it's not good. Now, the other week, in fact, I had to go and buy some slitting discs um, because I thought that I had run out of slitting discs. As it happens, I hadn't. Um, but I went out and bought some slitting discs. So I went, and this is a bit of a bit of a buying advice thing. Now I'm not sponsored by anybody here. Um, this is stuff that I, bu I bought uh, by myself. So I went to my favourite uh, supplier of sitting discs and they didn't have any. I went to my second favourite supplier of sitting discs and they didn't have any. And my third favourite supplier of sitting discs and they didn't have any either. And then I went to the, the big box uh, hardware store place and they had sitting discs but they were stupidly expensive. And then I went to the uh, the proper hardware store, and they had slitting discs, and they were even more stupidly expensive, but they had boxes of slitting discs. So rather than paying six euros for one slitting disc, yeah, really, six euros, um, which is quite a lot, I think most people agree, I managed to pick up a box of third slitting discs. So these are brand name slitting discs. Um, that's a box of 25 third slitting discs. One millimeter uh, built for stainless, uh, stainless and steel. Uh, so 25 of them. And uh, they cost me 24 euros. So less than a euro a pop. Third slitting discs they're really good they're really really nice to use and they go through steel like a hot knife through butter at one euro a pop 
definitely, or less than one euro a pop, definitely worth a punt. But that's not what I'm going to talk to you about. This is what I'm going to talk to you about. These slitting discs. These slitting discs came from everybody's favourite super budget store, Action. Action, I think there's, I think it's available in the UK. I don't know if they're available in the US. They're certainly available all the way across, uh, all the way across uh, Europe. Um, they're a bit like Lidl, Aldi, and all that sort of stuff. And the same stuff goes for for what you can find in Lidl and Aldi. These are 1.2 millimeter slitting discs. Um, they're standard, 1. Uh, 125 millimeter. So what was that? Four and a half inches for for the septics. Um, so they're slightly thicker than the than the third ones, so they last slightly longer. Um, they also go through steel like a hot knife through butter, and that was a pack of twelve that I picked up for four euros, which makes them about thirty centimes a piece. Now that blows away any idea of spending real money on slitting discs. Um, just go into your local super budget store and clean the fuckers out. You don't find deals like that. That's that's one where you could you know you could bite your arm off to get a deal better than that. Um, there's the one that I used to cut uh, to notch the hundred mil tube that uh, that I'm making the head of the mill from. Um, it's lost three millimeters off its diameter and that was a horrible horrible cut that really de does wear down discs um, if you know how to know how to use grinding discs they don't wear down all that fast you can get an awful lot of cuts out of them out of them um, what it mostly comes down to is not forcing and not plunging if you if you go gently cut with the edge of the disc rather than as has happened on this one uh, allowing the disc to go through, uh, can we see here? Yeah, allowing the disc to go through the metal and rub on the side. Um, your discs will last an awful lot longer. And while we're at it, just a bit, done a bit of grinding. That's close enough to being to being square. That I'm not going to worry too much about it. I've got maybe a hundredth of offset over there. That's pretty good going. Welding's going to distort it anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Double check that we're okay. I'm move there. Move there. Yeah, I got about a hundredth of a mil. That's pretty good. Happy with that. 